Now the latest from the Scotts Bluff Body and Paint Sports Desk. Scotts Bluff Body and Paint, you're driving home our reputation. Postseason time is here for the winter sports season. Plus, we do have another local signing. Today, tomorrow, and through late Saturday afternoon, it's the state wrestling tournament in Omaha for the boys and the girls. Early session today featuring Class B and Class C boys. Afternoon session for day one, Class A, Class D, and all girls brackets. We'll have state wrestling reports throughout all three days. Plus, you can find results on our website for state wrestling. Tonight, a big night for girls, Class C and D sub-district basketball with championship games scattered across the region. We're going to broadcast that C-112 final with 23-0 Bridgeport at 23-0 Sydney. Should be outstanding. KMOR 93-3 pregame will start at 5:45. Top seeds Baird, Morrill, and Layton also hosting sub-district championship games tonight. All winners and wild cards will play in district finals one week from tomorrow. Now, let's get to the signing from earlier this week as Garing senior Mitch Morvek inked to continue his career on the gridiron. He'll play football at Black Hill State in Spearfish, South Dakota. Um, I think it all kind of came down to um, the campus and the academics uh, as well as the football coaches. Um, they were always just really friendly and inviting to me. Um, ever since camp this summer, they, they really kind of showed me that they wanted me there. Uh, and I think that means a lot to me personally. Morvenk finished with over 100 tackles in his career at Gearing. He had three sacks this past year as a senior. He is planning on playing on the defensive side of the football to start at Black Hills, but he was versatile at Gearing as well, had 37 catches over the last three seasons. He credits his time in the Gearing program for helping him reach this point. Uh, I definitely think I grew a lot at Gearing, um, uh, especially in my high school career. Uh, I went from being a freshman who's kind of scared to play uh, varsity football, even JV football, to growing to love the game and just getting on uh, on whatever stage I could be. And Gearing head coach Danny O'Boyle, yeah, he knows a thing or two about playing football at the Division II level, and Coach O'Boyle says Morvenk has plenty of the necessary traits to be successful. Um, just his skill set overall. You know, he, he's got some character traits that, that fit multiple positions. Um, and it ultimately came down to being able to trust Mitch in those positions, you know, whereas it would come down to, okay, well, we can move maybe this person here, we can, we can put Mitch there, and we know what we're going to get out of Mitch every single time. And it's 110% effort, and um, whatever the job at hand is, it's going to be done, and it's going to be done aggressively and uh, in a good football mindset. So um, he just brings a lot of skills to the table that allows us allowed us to move him around to a lot of different spots. Gearing senior Mitch Morvenk signing earlier this week to continue his football career at Black Hill State in South Dakota. That's the latest today from right here at the Scotts Bluff Body and Paint Sports Desk. I'm Chris Cottrell.